Okay, due to popular demand, um, well, Gary and Stuart, <laughs> uh, I'm going to do a wee slide lick of the day. Again, pretty much the first one, I'm going to do is approximately a lick, but I want to show you something, you know, kind of ideas that will work um, right across a 12 bar blues. Now, I play slide in standard tuning, so you've got to, there's compromises you've got to make. Um, very often, I play, for those of you that know modal playing, I play modally, um, but that's probably for another day, or if you want to get lessons off me, quick advert. But you know what, I'll play stuff like where I'm in G, you know, a blues and... I'll actually be playing in the key of C, and that's a, another thing. Okay, but for this one, I'm going to stick to something fairly straightforward. It'll be close to the, the, the one lick, and what we're going to do is do it right across a 12 bar. Here's the notes, pretty much, that we're going to be using. First string, um, 10th fret, 9th, 8th, and then the second string, the 11th, the eighth, might put in the tenth there as well. And then on the third string, the um, seventh, and then the tenth. And what we're going to do is something close to this, this lick. Now again, I can use hybrid picking, and with this, very often with this, just depends on the sound I want, I'll either use plectrum or fingers. So just see what feels best to you. I mean a lot of slide players use their fingers so which is why I'll have that available to me. There's uh, fingers, plectrum, um, so it just depends. Okay so here's approximately what we're going to do. As I say I'll play it then with a back track and you'll get the idea because you'll need to shift slightly to change uh, with the chords, but they're all available round about here. Um, you know, and it's that kind of BB King shape. Should have pulled the face there. Okay, um, so. You get that? And I'll just vary that slightly by a fret or two. Um, maybe for the, you know, when it goes up to the D, or sorry, we're playing this in G. So when it goes up to the D, we've got that D on the first string. And then we've got C in the first string. Okay. I'll put it on the back track and let you hear what it, how it is. So, that's roughly the idea in G, and those frets, okay, hope that's of use to you sliders, um, big finger. <laughs>